Hi, my name is Shanali Mahajan and uh, I started Studio Udhas in 2014. Uh, I arrived back from Milan in 2011 after which I worked with international and uh, Indian interior design firm. Studio Udhas primarily focuses on designing spaces for the hospitality, residential and commercial sectors. We also dabble in some product design and um, work in creating and organizing interesting design workshops. Bharat Tiles and I go back a couple of years when I started Studio Woodhouse. Um, with also a friend of mine and uh, I, I really appreciate the uh, craftsmanship behind the cement tiles that they make. Um, we have done some workshops with Fridos on uh, cement products and going to the factory was a great experience because uh, you get to see products that you have designed and, and your creations come alive immediately. So the Shibori collection uh, started, I, I started designing this maybe a couple of months ago uh, when after, after we did a workshop on Shibori textile dyeing which was absolutely amazing and it was really um, inspiring because you don't know what you're going to get. You don't know uh, what design is going to come through, what fold is going to give you what pattern. So it's really raw, it's really natural and I think that resonates with what Studio Woodhouse tries to do, what my personality is as a designer, where you give a little bit and you try um, you try creating the design and you try creating the parameters but you don't really um, plan each detail which is what shibori uh, the technique allows the japanese form of dyeing so after this and after this, these processes and after doing these workshops i kind of studied the patterns that formed and these repetitive patterns that formed and used those uh, to create more structured geometric forms that could be replicated and you could use many different color palettes to uh, to work on the floor and these days people are getting more and more bold about the patterns that they'd like to use, about the colors that they'd like to use, about forms. So um, we, we started off by using the Shibori uh, lines and forms and then tweaked them to, uh, uh, to work with color palettes that are not uh, otherwise associated with Shibori. Uh, so more neutral, more pastels because uh, Shibori is always associated with indigo and we felt that this might be a nice way to introduce the indigo but take it forward to other color palettes so it could have um, a wider reach.